knows? Some say the regen happens when the uh, DPF is at a hundred percent. So it's hundred percent right now. Regen is off. So I might need to wait till it says 101. All right. So it's still at a hundred. It changed to ACT. I would say active maybe. Huh? Not quite sure what that actually means, but. Yeah, so right now it is here 1 p.m. So I'll just keep driving until that ACT turns off and see what time it is at that time. All right. All right, came to a stop light. And regen is off right now. 100% still. Um, the difference was on a stoplight, engage it in park just to see if the idle would change or if it would still stay. But, um, oh, yeah, I guess it needs to be running active once again. So, anyway, stay tuned. And it is um, 105 in about 5 minutes. Okay, came to another light, but uh, just gonna leave it on idle and see if this uh, if it just stays active. Yeah, I guess so. It just stay active there. All right, stay tuned. I guess one thing I noticed right now is that uh, exhaust gas temp there it's at 900 degrees to a thousand degrees. So yeah, it looked like it definitely is in a region so it's um yeah Let's see how long it takes so i'm just on an open road right now i'm driving and see how long this region actually takes all right stay tuned all right been you no know, another three minutes it's the first time i actually own a truck with that needs to get regen I had a 05 Commons and um, yeah so it's first time uh, experiencing this uh, regen so as you can see the exhaust gas temp is a little higher um, now in a thousand so yeah we see how long miles it actually takes for it to um, get the DPF down to zero so anyway all right stay tuned all right regen just went off particulate matter now is 14 it is 117 so oh it's about um few hour a uh, few minutes 17 minutes um, all right so stay tuned all right just made a u-turn I'm gonna, gonna see get that EGT is uh, slowly going back decreasing um, now it back to normal 800 I think normally cruising is about 500 on the Fahrenheit temperature on the exhaust gas. Um, yeah, so like the region, yeah, takes about there, like you said, between 10 15 minutes. They say started at about 1 p.m. Like I said, after a few minutes, five minutes, um, went to a stoplight. See if I could hear any idle difference. Some say, you know, you can hear the engine. Um, in the engine bay itself, with everything closed, I couldn't quite, you know, I couldn't smell anything in the cab, so which was really good. Um, idle scene, the engine was at the same idle. Um, little below uh, the 
1000 and he was idling I think I might have had a small clip um, but yeah um, I don't think without this gauge which I just installed yesterday without this uh, eye dash I wouldn't have known if if it went into regen um, you know any other time so see right now I have um, and my mileage is uh, 2100 uh, miles on the truck and I'm not sure if this is the first regen uh, look like on that time there it says a DE uh, DPF time uh, last time was 1100 I think it was 54 it showed and now it shows uh, 1175 so I don't know if that's when about how many minutes you're going to regen just the way I've been driving um, yeah I don't know it's been well worth me getting this gauge right now it just paid off I was able to at least know when the truck went into regen and uh, I was able to drive it get the you know uh, DPF back down to right now 11% which is awesome as soon as it was done it was at 14 so it's, it's still dropping but anyway uh, yeah exhaust gas temp is at 7 50 right now you know ambient is at 87 degrees where I'm at at this time so yeah um, same as that that's pretty good um, air ambient air in uh, air temperature is at 87 on this gauge and again ambient temperature on the truck dash this 2021 shows 87 so yeah man pretty happy with this i dash 1.8 super gauge uh, from banks so awesome stay tuned for more uh, updates on mods click and subscribe and have a good one